Good morning, everybody. Brian and Darcizzle here, or AKA Puddin, and we are headed out offshore fishing today out of beautiful Stewart, Florida. Yeah, we got Stanley Frank with us today, and we're gonna catch him up. The wind came around to the north, so it should be I good for like, mahi and yeah. sailfish. And it's a little cooler this morning. And we'll do some bottom fishing, and we're gonna make the best of it. We've got some bait already from the Stewart Live Bait Guy. We're going over to Bull Shark Barge right now to get some more bait. Let's go. And so we'll see you there. Let's do it. All right, nice guys. Stuff. Right here on the Six Mile Reef. It's a little bumpy out, so we didn't really go too far. This is really the closest spot to start fishing. Come on. Darcy thinks he's getting a bite. So, uh, conditions are a little choppy for us, but no big deal. Just gotta fish what the good Lord gives you. Sizzle, you gonna catch me a fish? I hope so. <laughs> I don't know. Just had some nice hits. Frank's over here, silent Frank, single ladies. We're on the spot, We're hitting the spot. Might even crank up a little He's bit. on. Ugh. You suck at fishing! Thought he was on. That was a huge mark. Look at that. Mark. Well, you probably got your weight stuck on it. What happened? No, 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 yes. no. That was a bite You're all day. Fisherman. Watch the bait's gone. You're a bad fisherman. I was not the bottom, Ryan. All right, guys, you got fish on. Hooked up. See what this is. Oh, I bunch of bait at Bull Shark. I didn't film it because it was a little yeah. choppy. I had to just keep the boat in gear. Yep. Got a little dance going on back here. Bonita has got a bunch with him. Holy crap. Oh, dolphin. Little dolphin swimming by. Little chicken dolphins. You got flat lines out, right? I got one. Woo. Got him. Shark bait. All right. Was he's not little? Nice. That's it's a good a solid size one, one, actually. Yeah. Bonita in the boat. We prefer not to eat these guys, so we're gonna probably use them for bait or let them go. There he is, nice size bonita. Very pretty. Gonna let him go. Let yeah, him go. Got plenty in the freezer. Do a good deed today. Send a fish back home and see if we can get something else on. Sizzle's on a good fish. Doesn't have a GoPro on. Frank, you're gonna help her, of course. This is a nice fish. All right, we're going to the left. Oh, running. Real. Brian, I'm trying. I know, baby. It's pulling. Clear this rod. What rod? Clear this short rod in front of me. Go under. So we got a big fish. Might be the big fish to catch of the day. Leader, coming up. Oh, Jesus, Louise. All right, hold up, rod sizzle. I, I got, got it, Brian. Go. Done. All right. Nice Woo! job. <laughs> Whew. What is that? Okay. Thanks. Oh, God. I, that was honestly one of those grunts. <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything until I got the fish to the boat because I thought it might be something good, <laughs> like a grouper or a snapper. And it fought real hard, too. It had so much flying out. But that guy ate that grunt I caught on that chicken rig. So it just goes to show you, match the hatch, put down what the fish are biting. And it took a while to get the bite, but when I did, you know, it's a quality AJ right there. So not bad, not bad. That's a keeper, we're close to a keeper. Nice fish. Ooh, he made me work for it. I thought it might've been a grouper. Woo! Yeah, and that bottom rig with the long leader, you know, you got a hand like that, so that's not fun with an AJ. No. That's not the target species for that rig, so. No, but this time we had gloves. <laughs> yeah, I can do gloves. Did the right thing this time. There we go. There's my AJ. Beautiful fish. Let's let him go. Head first. Going for a very long swim, and we're going to let him get big so we can catch him when he's a huge 100-pound reef donkey. So we might not be catching exactly what we want to target or whatever, like something Bend crazy. but. Bend the rods, I mean, so far we've caught two bonitas. Yeah. A kingfish, which is off camera. Uh, that AJ, a mutton. Bunch of grunts. Bunch of, bunch of grunts, a bunch of remoris. Yeah. So, uh, I mean, you are getting some fish. Yeah, it's not a bad day. Not the worst day, no. No. Pretty good. But it is a little on the slow side. But again, this is why it's called fishing and not catching. So we got to get back on it while we still got the major going on. Catch them up. Oh, we got some dolphin behind the boat again. Nice, we got one. You got one hooked up? Yeah. Woo, way to go, Frank. Good job, Frank. You're underneath me. There he is, he's on that side, follow him. You Googans. I think I got one on. I don't think he's a keeper. I think I got one on. Flip him in, Frank. I do have one on. All right, just flip him in, Frank, he's not a keeper. Frank, hold this rod. Guys, I need to get over this line, I'm sorry. All right, here you go, watch this rod. 
stuck in the ladder, dude. Oh, why is he stuck in the ladder? He's underneath the ladder, you goof. This is through the ladder and in the boat. Here you go. All right, I'm keeping all the dolphin right here. We got them all right here. Let's start getting lines in. Right here is a nice, there's a nice one right here. Let's, so let's get him off and pitch at this one here. Squid on, chunks, chunks, bleh. squid chunk on. And pitch over here, so if I can get them closer. I got like 10 fish over here. They're all right here. One reeler in closer. Don't let those little guys get. You can just drop it and let it drift. Yeah, he's a nice one right there. He's turning for it. There he goes. And let him eat it. Open the bale. Let him eat it. Let him eat it and then close. On. Nice. Now follow your fish. He's over there. You're going to have to go under. Yeah, there you go. Another fish on. Yeah, buddy. All right, you both got two on, right? Woo! Woo! That's yeah. a nice one. Tripled up on dolphin right now. That's a nice one. We all one. got one. We all got one. All right. Cricker gap or net? I don't care. All right, I so just, got mine in the water. I just put mine in the boat. I don't fool around. <laughs> Woo, keeper! Nice fish. Catching dolphins. Let's go. Nice. In the boat. We got another. And I got still one on the line over there, keeping them by the boat. That's what you do. <laughs> That's what you do. Nice. We got dolphin on. All right, all right, all right. Let's get a couple more. Fish flopping yeah, everywhere. Dolphin all over. Yeah, that was a nitro dolphin too that he caught. Oh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You have pliers? Right there. right there in front of your face. Right there in front of your face. Right. You mind if I use the ones in my hand? I get a bait off. Those are those are definitely keepers. Yeah, he's 20. Right, you want to get this one, Sizzle? I'm leaving her there for now. All right, so you can see right here, guys, that's the difference. You got the camera on, right? Yeah. That's the difference between a male and a female mahi-mahi. The male has a sharper, broader head, which is in this hand right here. The female has a much, um, a more, much more of a curve to her head. So that makes you, that's the difference between the two. And when they get bigger, as you guys saw in our video a couple weeks ago when we caught those monsters, you could definitely tell the difference between the male and the female. So with mahi-mahi fishing, you always want to have, try to hook one because they stay in schools together. So I have one hooked right here by the side of the boat and that's what's keeping all the mahi around. We also have the flippy floppy out, which I highly recommend on the Amazon store down below. But we're just teaching you guys how we do it out here. So you can come out here and do this too. All right, so we got three, we got three keeper dolphin in the boat. These, these are what you would call a chicken dolphin or a schoolie dolphin. Um, because again, they, they're one of the fastest growing fish in the sea. Let's see if I can get this guy in the boat. That's how you do it, flipping in dolphin, and that is a keeper. So that's the first fish I hooked, and then I just kept her in the water next to us, so that way we could catch more fish. So we've got four now. That will make some delicious fish tacos right there. Heck yeah, gorgeous lit up fish. Beautiful. Got to be 20 to the fork to keep. I'll just triple check just in case, but I'm sure we're good to go. All right, this fish is 23 to the fork. It is a keeper. That's all that matters in my book. Still dinner, and they all look exactly the same on the dinner plate and on your fork. <laughs> nice. Beautiful fish. She's got a bunch following her, too. We got no lines rig. Another one. Oh, boy. It's K Mayhem. Mayhem. You're going to flip them. Oh, I have a weight here. Damn it. That'll slide down. It's not sliding. Another fish in the boat. Look at that. We're slaying the mahi mahi. Not bad day so far. The minor moon phase is producing. Circle hook just popped right out of the corner. We've already lost a couple fish, but that's okay. We also don't need to go too crazy and catch a ton of these guys. It just ate. Oh my God, big dolphin. Did it just eat it? No. Wait, yeah. no, you're hooked up. Doubled up, doubled up. Let's go, let's go. Doubled up. Yes, sir. Oh, I got a bit. Are we both hooked to the same fish? We're hooked on the Brian, you need to get the gaff now. Let me okay, get the gaff. Okay. We're hooked on the same fish. I got the gaff. Right here. Oh, I'm double wrapped, I see. All right, all right. where is he? Right here, Brian. A little bit closer. Sorry, let him run, let him run. Here. Real Frank. Sick. 
quick. All right. Oh God. Oh God. All right, she's taking drag on my line. Unreal. Nice Trouble job. Fish. Good job, Ryan. Oh. Woo! Woo! That was a nightmare, but we did it. That's a stud. <laughs> nice gaffer. Hell yeah. Team effort, baby. Look at that circle hook right in the corner of the mouth, doing its job. Of course, that's a mustache circle hook. And what happened here was my bottom rod was out, and the fish ate the top line, but somehow managed to get wrapped in my bottom rig as well. So this is a really dangerous situation because she's got two lines in her, in her mouth here, and the other line could have popped this hook or cut the hook. So we honestly are super, super lucky we caught this fish. So I was trying to like hold my bottom rod because it was wrapped in her, in her corner of her mouth even though she didn't eat my bait. So a pretty of a big mess right there, but you know what, fish is in the boat. A little bit of a missed gaff shot there, but that's why it's, hey. <laughs> that's why it's a team effort. There we go. But watch, I'm gonna cut this hook, which is a hook Frank caught him, caught him on. What was that, a live pilchard? Yeah. Okay, and so this just fed that through. Oh, you know what, she ate both baits. Yeah, ate both baits. She ate my bottom rig. Okay, at first, for a second I thought it was I'm wrapped, but she ate, the bottom rig and the top rig. So she had two lines in her mouth and I had a huge weight on mine. So it was terrible because I'm trying to film and hold my line out because she was hooked on both rods. It was a nightmare. But you know what? Let's check her out. That is a nice fish and she's not done yet. She's angry. She's beautiful. angry because I put so many holes in her. Yes, Ryan put so <laughs> many holes in her. That's a That's beautiful fish. A little lower, Female. I guess, face. Female and she's bleeding profusely from the tail. But you know what? She's in the boat. That's all that matters. The gaff shots just come later, but you, the, you know, gaff shot got her in the boat. I don't care how many times it takes. I stabbed her to death. She's in the boat. <laughs> yeah, she literally stabbed her to death, and she totally inhaled my hook. It's gone. That's crazy. She ate two baits. That's a hungry fish. Hey, Sizzle, show everyone how you lift that fish with one hand. Oh, yeah. A lot of people ask online how I'm lifting fish with one hand. Let me show you. <laughs> Pretty simple. <laughs> well, make it look like Photoshop. So tilt it like this. I'm not a... Uh, I'm not the biggest, I mean, I'm not a tiny girl and I'm not a giant girl either, but I out. do make fish look big. Push it out. I'm, this is pretty far out. This, yeah. She's extended out pretty far right now, but that's about the distance I held that big 20 pound dolphin and everybody swore it was Photoshop. So you know what? Y'all are watching the videos. You know what's Photoshop and what's not, and we're real with y'all. We don't lie. In the box. We gotta clean up. Look at this mess back here. That's dolphin fishing for you. That's a good day. It's a fishing boat. That's how it's supposed to look. Woo! All right, Frank's got another dolphin on. I'm gonna leave mine pretty close here, Frank, so we don't get too tangled, okay? Mahi, mahi, dolphin. We call them all of these things. So just don't mind us with our switching, name switching. Twice. And just flip them over. There you go. Nice job. Nice fish. Heck yeah. Slaying mahi, mahi today. Slaying them. Come on up, Dar Sizzle. Woohoo. Yay. <laughs> made it back. We made it back. Another great day in the water. Another beautiful day. It's pretty crazy that we have north winds in the middle of June, but you know what? We made it happen. We got some fish to the boat, and we just hooked up some fellas at the dock that were going out fishing with live bait, with our extra live yeah, bait. Yeah, extra. So, that was nice. Yeah, and I also forgot to mention these awesome sterling silver mahi pendants that are available as well. Might as well show you since I'm wearing it today for, lucky, for luck, and we caught mahi. Available on my website, as well as awesome other, a lot of awesome other nautical charms, <laughs> just to name a few, redfish, um, I'm drawing a blank now. Redfish tail, Redfish, snook, snook, sailfish, uh, sailfish lots pounders. of awesome stuff. So check right. it out, y'all. Awesome. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, when you see our next video, well, actually, we're headed out of town right, right now. Hold, hold on. We're take, headed out take, of town. Take it easy, baby. I think you're I know, I think I'm you're excited. Adrenaline. I think I'm excited. <laughs> well, we are headed out of town to go film some awesome, amazing fishing yeah, adventures for you guys. Yeah, in about 12 hours, So we're get leaving. ready for that. Get yeah. ready for that. Stay tuned. All right. I'm going to wrap it up. <laughs> I sound like Brian on top of Yeah, you're really fast. slow. Take it easy, baby. Okay. All Until right. our next adventure, follow, follow your dreams, dreams and keep, keep on catching. Follow your dreams. Follow your dreams. Follow your dreams. I have dream. more than one dream. <laughs>